You there. Do you want to know how to build like a champion? Then look no further. So in the last episode, I said I was going to build something grand. It's going to be a wizard thing. Yes. <laughs> I pushed the land back right here because I'm going to build it right here. It's going to be a wizard tower overlooking this area. It's going to be a starter home because I'm going to be building a Hogwarts type castle right there. And there's going to be magical crap and stuff. Have you clicked away yet? So, the blocks you will need if you want to build this are stone bricks, mossy stuff, cobblestone, and crimson planks, as well as lanterns. Bruce, if you're wondering how to grow crimson trees, place a, 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 a crimson fungus and you bone meal it, and then you start digging it up. But it has to be growing, it has to grow on uh, crimson nilium whatever that word is. To know how to build a tower, you need to understand circles in Minecraft. I don't, so I'll leave a video about circles in the description. This is going to be a 13, so to build a 13 you want to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, I need to move it. I'm actually gonna build up on the dirt here. What's that word called? Excavating? Nope. Terraforming. Yeah. That's the word. And you want to make sure if you're terraforming, you make sure the inside is light up, lit up if it's hollow because you don't want mobs spawning in here and being loud. That would be annoying. You wouldn't want to do that. Just just light it up. Torches are cheap and therefore you can uh, you, you get, get, use a lot. After you do it, you want to take back and look at it because Ow! yeah, they, they look like that. <laughs> and we don't we don't want it to look like that. We want it to sort of look natural but also flattened out at the same time. So what we have to do is add more blocks right there, and I think that's what I'm going to do right now. There's something a little pointy over here I'm going to get rid of, but I think that's it after I get rid of the pointy. I will definitely need to find a way, a better way up, or make a better way up. Because, uh, this is, that's a little unacceptable. Alright, now, I'm going to build my circle. I want to have a little bit of r room right there, so I'm going to do the two blocks there. One, two, three, four, five. Two blocks. Nope. Two blocks. Two blocks. And then that would be that one there. And that one there should be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven? I, is that what I want? I think I wanted thirteen. I'll go into my test world and find out. Wordle? <laughs> okay, so I went into my test world and found out it is eleven. One, two, three, four. Wait, 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 wait. Get. What are you doing? Yeah, that's what I want. And then, like, having backyard. Yes, perfect. This is perfect. And then uh, you'll have stairs going on the outside of it, like this. We got the general circle laid out. So, when you're building, you don't want to make square builds because that's boring, and no one wants boring. You want to have depth to your builds, right? I mean, I know I would. I know I do. That's what I want in my builds. I want depth. I'm rambling on. Uh, we'll, we'll do some spruce around the wall here, and these pillars right here will be um, stone. Um, so the door is going to be here, so this, this block will matter. For now, I'm going to put stone there, but uh, you're going to put a pillar here. I keep calling them the wrong things. It's a brick, stone brick wall. Shoot. So we'll start off by doing this right here. We'll put fences here, and then cobblestone walls up here, up, up here. And then we'll add the door. Now this is a special trick I learned from Waddles. If you don't know who Waddles is, then uh, check him out. Uh, you put the door on this block rather than the inside block, and it gives it depth, so it's not just flush against everything. And then you put that there, this here. The wall is made of spruce, and then you got one block high for the ceiling, so you don't bump your head. And then you strip a few of these, not all of them, all right, and now what we do is add spruce logs right, uh, man, my inventory is full. Right there and right there, and then we'll add some stone buttons right there and there. You see where this is going? And then this is a cool trick I learned from Trixie Blocks. 
fence gates like that and it just adds so much to the build you see where we're going with this so what you want to do is add texture to your build so the wall itself is right here so you got one two three i've got three and we're gonna add uh lanterns hanging out too so i've got three whole uh blocks here on my build you could even change it up a little bit and add some logs going straight up and down and uh, see, so yeah, I did it for this stripped one too, just to give it to extra the extra variety that it needs. Um, I might do it a little bit on this one too. I'm, I'll do it on this one, and uh, I'll do it on this one here and this one here, just like that. And I'm realizing a lot of this is just me waiting on that to grow so I might have to AFK and go eat lunch while that grows but I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger foist but this is what I got so far I built all the walls and I'm just adding uh, the outsides part of it uh, I'm making this side a little bit more mossy because it's closer to the ocean and I feel like when there's storms big waves come and crash up on this hill and then make it all mossy and then as you get over here you know there's still the wind comes from that way mostly. There's less moss here. So on the second floor, I do this design here. And I do need dark oak for here so it can blend in better with the spruce log, which I might ha I'll have to take a trip over there. But um, yeah, this is what it's looking like so far. And then the walls just go up. And then in the corners of these spots right here, you got crimson fences cobblestone walls and the crimson fence they go straight up the entire tower and uh, in between each section so it goes cobblestone wall skip cobblestone wall skip in between the empty spaces right there I put a um, connection lost <laughs> and in between the walls here I put lanterns and it goes all the way up so when you have shaders on which we'll be looking at it with shaders on uh, it looks amazing it looks really good let me look with, see what that looks like with spruce stairs, though, before I uh, make any rash decisions. Now, the choice is yours here. You can either have it sitting on each wall or hanging from each wall. Uh, the choice is yours. I'm probably going to have mine hanging just because it has that little extra bit of... Um, pick this up, please. It has that little extra bit of chain right there, which just adds to the build even more. Also, if you don't want to use this crimson wood in your build, you don't have to. You can use any wood type of wood. You can change any of these blocks out that you want. If you like the overall design of this, how I'm laying this out, then you can change out any block you want. For up here, we'll do stripped spruce logs and I need one facing out. Or two facing out, my bad. So all these will be stripped. Just like that. And then we'll add... I've got... More of these fence going up right here. And then it caps off with a cobblestone wall. Right there. And then right there. That goes out like that. And then you'll add the chain here. Bing bong. And then a lantern right there. And then we put these right here. And now I want you to know you can have these open like that if you want. I might have it that way. So I have it open, closed, open, and then I'm going to have another one closed up top uh, on the top of the other floor. So, we're going to do that. And on the, let's see, the inside of this window, so you got a floor there, one, two, three, a floor here. So the window is literally just this entire thing. I put trap doors all right there to uh, give it some color on the outside. You'll see what that looks like here in just a second after I get this dirt block. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Alright, now that that's over with, uh, uh, don't worry about that. 
But um, yeah, this is pretty much what every side is going to look like. I still need to do some stuff on that side, but I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Alright, that goes there. And then Sea Lantern right here. Ooh. I like it. This is almost making me think we need to do these as the blue ones. I don't know. Or should we put glowstone there? Or oh, I don't know. Let me let me experiment a little bit. Can you see how magnificent this thing is going to be? Just a strong tower. You are my strong tower. Sheltered over me. You're the fallen my You know, it may have too much going on, but you know, that's okay. I don't care. I like it right now. And I'm I'm honestly in the learning stage of building as well. Okay, so I finished all of the walls. All of them look the same except for the front which obviously has the door. I ended up changing the front here back to a simpler design because it got a little too crowded for my liking. It is, you could say it's crowded now, but uh, it's not crowded for me. This is, this is about as far as I would go with the amount of detail in a build. This is not really a how-to video of how to build, I'm just sort of trying to entertain I guess. Does that make sense? I can make a how-to video how to build in different styles if you guys want me to. Let me know if you want me to. My allergies are acting up, so if I sound a little stuffy, I, 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 I apologize. I'm sorry. Next, I'm going to be doing the roof, but I have to mine some more of this wood. Wood! Because I actually ran out. It's just a hollow shell right now, by the way. Oh, I put trap doors behind here. I don't remember if I saw this or not. This is 24 hours later, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I put trap doors behind there to give it uh, some more color in the back there. I, I'm debating on putting glass there, but it might be a little bit too much color because I'm wanting to get all the color from uh, the, uh, what's it called? <laughs> Crimson fences. That's the word. That's the word. All right, it's roof time. And this one is going to be built a little differently. Do this, and then this, this, and then block. Nope, nope, not like that. Block here, 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 there, and then another one out like this, like this, like this, and then like this. This is so much easier and creative. <laughs> And I'm finished. This is what it looks like, my friends. Maybe I should have got some blocks to build up with. There it is. 
in all of its glory. I love it. It looks like it has a sturdy foundation. It looks great. I love it. I'm happy with it. And uh, I think that's all that matters. <laughs> it's got a really pointy roof. I incorporated some fences and stairs when I got closer to the top. It's a little different from my original design. My original design is a little bit more boxy. This one has more of a, a swoop pattern to it because I incorporated the stairs and the fences and I just made things a little bit taller. Um, but yeah, this is just an empty shell at the moment. It's nothing like uh, there's nothing in special inside. It has three floors, so I can I have room to add on uh, a bunch of stuff. I gotta remove the dirt at the top. <laughs> it's not gonna stay, trust me. But uh, I've pretty much this is just a shell. I still gotta decorate on the outside a little bit more. Um, nothing more on the building because there's a lot on the building. Um, but I mean like greenery, like I'm gonna bone meal the grass through here. It's gonna look really good and detailed. There's gonna be a path through here. But it's going to be night soon. I'm going to turn on my shaders and show you what it looks like at night. And I'm so excited to show you what it looks like. Oh, there's a spider over there. Oh, man, it looks so good. I love it. <laughs> Can you imagine this? Like, sort of this design and stuff, but, like, different ones all over the place. And then, like, in this same sort of style, a big, like, Hogwarts castle right over there on that island, surrounded by walls and magic. And there you have it. Man, this thing's lit up like a Christmas tree with the shaders on. It's pretty uh, pretty impressive, if I don't say so myself. It's probably one of the better, better builds I've ever built in my life. Guys, I'm starting to upload every Tuesday and Friday. It's my regular, that's my new regular schedule to upload. Check out my other videos, yo. <laughs>